What's going on, people? This is Ghost here, and I'm here to bring you the top 10 plays of the season so far, brought to you by Real Tough Talk. It was kind of hard to choose between these plays, but I feel we were able to narrow it down to the 10 best plays. I hope that you enjoy. Number 10 will be Izzy of Street Fam making a great catch in between two Carver Mob defenders. No one expected him to come down with it. He does, and he's able to put points on the board for Street Fam. Great catch by Izzy. And number 9 will be Brian of Reloaded versus Woodlawn making a great jumping catch in between a couple of defenders while staying in bounds. When Brian jumps for the ball, it's hard to deny that he's coming down with it. Great catch by Brian. And number 8 will be Swiss of Dumb Getters showing exactly why they went out their way to pick him up. He makes a nice catch and makes some moves on Street Fam's defense to run into the end zone untouched. Almost looks too easy for him out there. Great play by Swiss. Number 7 will be JP of House Gang versus the Browns, making a great one-handed interception in the end zone, showing that even though he's unfamiliar with defense, he can make big plays where it counts. Great play by JP. Number six will be Joel of Raw versus IOD, making his own rendition of the one-handed interception, showing that he can make big plays whenever he chooses to, wherever he chooses to. What a great one-handed grab by Joel. Number 5 will be Cecil of the Generals versus House Gang, coming out of nowhere and picking off the ball and taking it back to the house, sealing the deal and winning the game, showing that no matter where he's on, where he's at on the field, he can make a play on it. Great play by Cecil. Number 4 will be Rico of YMM versus Reckless, making a great diving interception, but he's not done yet. He gets up and takes it back for 6 points. This shows that there's no pass too high or too low for Rico to get to. Great play. Number 3 will be Joel of Raw versus Violators with a great dive and catch for the touchdown, showing that every play that he's in is a great play waiting to happen. Great play by Joel. Number two will be why we call him Megatron of them getters because he towers over all the defenders of Rep City. That once he was in the air, he had no chance of being stopped from making that play, showing why he's a dominant force in this league. And number one on our countdown will be Brian of Reloaded versus Riot Squad, making a great catch, not only jumping over the defenders of Riot Squad, but using them as a safety mat to break his fall as he comes down. Showing why he was Offensive Player of the Year last year and why he's on his way to defending his title this year. Great play by Brian. And there you have it. That was our top 10 of the season so far. If you agree with our list or if you don't, let us know on the guest book or on Facebook. We thank you for watching and hope that we see you again for our next top 10. This is Ghost signing off.